Following breaking news out of Southeast Boise, where crews are battling a brush fire near Micron, BLM says that they got reports of a fire near Columbia Road and Golden Eagle Lane at 320 this afternoon. This is being called the Leeds Fire. We have learned it has spread to about 200 acres. I want to send it out now to our Abby Davis, who is live out in the area. She is following the latest. Uh, Abby, I think, uh, yep, there she is. It's a little windy out there. Abby, what do you know? What do you see out there? It is Joe and Brenda. We actually hiked up a trail to this ridge to try to get you guys a little bit of a better look at the fire. It's tough to get as close as possible right now because some of the roads are blocked off. But like Joe and Brenda said, it is about 200 acres. Things are moving fast, though. It keeps growing and growing. You can see all of that smoke. It's a little bit tough to differentiate between the smoke and the clouds right now, but it is there very substantial. You can definitely smell it, or at least I can, because of course I am in the area. We know that this is burning east of Micron, a couple of miles east. Again, so far about 200 acres, but just to give you an idea for how fast things are growing. When I talked to the Bureau of Land Management PIO around 355, he told me it was 15 acres at that time. So it has really exploded in that amount of time. We don't know yet or haven't been told how it started. Bureau of Land Management says that that is, of course, under investigation. Technology Way and Gowan Road that goes to Micron into some of those subdivisions that this fire is threatening. That is completely blocked off by first responders. We know BLM, of course, is on scene. Boise Fire, Eagle Fire, Ada County Sheriff's Office. They have crews out here as well. There's no estimated time of when crews will get things under control, but they are trying to, uh, again, get this uh, contained as fast as possible. I did talk to the PIO again about five minutes ago, and he says, again, homes are threatened at this time, but that they are making good progress. They are putting fire protection in nearby, and so they're just really trying to keep those flames away. But he said in his own words that things are looking good. Of course, you could take that um, however you want, considering that the flames are burning close to those homes. But he says that crews are trying their very best right now and that, again, things are looking uh, uh, as good as possible um, at this moment. All right. Abby Davis is on scene out there. Abby, we'll check in with you as you get some more information.